Hello everybody and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. We have not been here in a while because last time I finished the hospital off. So I thought, well, while I'm busy with a few other things, we'll take a tiny break from Two Point. But now we are back in Flemington. So I got a few career rewards on the, uh, just quite a few on the last couple of hospitals. So three stars in Tumble. Yes. 15 stars in all. Yes. Got 1,000 patients. Woohoo. 20 research projects, woo! -hoo. 50 doctors, 50 nurses, 25 machines upgraded, 3,000 kudos, very nice. Oh, and earn 5,000 kudos. I must have spent a couple of thousand already. So let's get to Flemington, shall we? Do we need dry lips? I'm gonna have some water. Oh, a big hospital, yes! Welcome to Flemington, a wealthy town where the people have more money than sense. I think we can make a killing here, pardon the expression, if we can get ourselves a marketing license. We can use marketing campaigns to improve our reputation, attract more patients, and recruit better staff. I suggest we focus our research and marketing on an illness that has been plaguing the area for a while. Animal magnetism. Avak has been telling me all about the animal magnetism machine. He's been like, oh, it's so funny. He, 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 he. And I'm like, okay, I will find out for myself. Shush. This part of the county is quite cold again. So I do need to put down some heaters and things. That's fine. Right. Let's uh, make a start. Well, we'll make a start with reception. And then I'm possibly going to just go away and build a very, very basic hospital here. And then put a hatch out on the back. A very basic little hospital around here. Uh, I don't know if we need more than one pod at the moment. Let's give them a filing cabinet. They can have at least one. And I think that will do for now. We could have a little char charity pot there. That's so cute. Let's spend all this stuff. A golden flower vase. Fancy. Yeah. More flowers. Yeah. Let's get loads of stuff that's like kind of not very many kudoshes. I mean, at the moment. It's not a huge amount. We could have a printer. I don't know what it does. I'm just unlocking things now. <gasps> okay, maybe we'll stop doing that. Um, no, I don't want to stop editing the room. No, 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 no. I think we're good now for reception. Reception needs an assistant. Blah, 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 blah. So I'm going to go away and I'm going to make a few rooms. GP surgery, things like that. And uh, I will bring you back when I have done that. And we can see the first few patients coming into the hospital. Okay? Okay, everybody, and I am back, and look at my beautiful hospital. So we have GP's offices, psychiatry, staff room, toilets, ward, general diagnosis, pharmacy, fluid analysis, cardiology, and a little space for any room that I may have forgotten about, because I might have done. So I think we need to hire some staff now, so let's have a little look. Um, so you can be a radiologist. That would be handy. Mentor, charming, magic healing hands, and paper aeroplane theoretician. Lovely. You could be our first doctor, and you can start off in. Queue up. Start off in the GP's office, and I would like another doctor. Well, Neam, you have. I don't know if I'm saying that right at all. It's probably Neem. Neem or something like that. Okay. Positive, great with napkins, good at GPing. In you go. The other doctor is no good at psychiatry, so we'll leave the psychiatry room free for now. I need some nurses for one, two, three, four, five, six nurses probably. So we'll start off with the ones we can get. Oh, injector room trained and pharmacy trained. Ooh, we don't have an injector room yet. I may have to build one at some point. A ward trained nurse, fantastic. Bit hangry, horse cutlery. Mm. Potential, unavoidably replaceable. Uh, green fingers, terribly dull, positive, and horse cut. 
celery makes people bored but likes to water plants when idle we're not going to do too much with plants minus 10 percent happiness mm. okay well we're hiring all of you you're going in the ward you are going in the pharmacy for now and inject them if you need to and uh you can go in general diag and if need be they can go to cardiology and everything else but i'm gonna actually get it playing now i think that's as many staff as we can manage so hopefully i'm actually gonna speed it up now because i've had it on pause for ages okay so i need to complete a pest control research patient and diagnose a patient with animal magnetism so we're probably going to need to make some money and expand the hospital fairly soon. So 60,000 for that one. 60,000 for that one. Oh, I didn't hire an assistant. Oh, good grief. Thank you, Mr. Pop-Up Man. Assistant to reception. There you go. And we'll probably need a couple of janitors as well. One with ghost capture would be handy, although I hope we won't need it. Puts all out of order signs on things that aren't. We've had many, many expenses now, but it's okay. It's okay. So I think a little research room over here would be a good thing then, because I need to research uh, pest control. I told you I need a little space for a room. Oh, I need a researchy doctor. Research his desk. Oh, I can't fit it in. Move this over so I can fit that. In. Okay, not the, the nicest research room in the whole world, but it'll have to do for now. In research. We have a psychiatry room and someone waiting for psychiatry, but no one trained in psychiatry. Let's see, do we have anybody trained in psychiatry yet? No. Might need to train. Oh, looking amongst the. Aha, Archibald Kitten, you are my new psychiatrist. Slash researcher. But when there's no one waiting for that, you can do research. Okay, Potty Mouth has been discovered and Mockstar has been discovered. Okay, cool. I should be able to treat all of those, hopefully. Oh, right, that one's in fluid analysis. Okay, I do probably need to hire some more nurses then. One that would be good at pharmacy would be good. There you go. In today's gossip I'm try and keep them to their Mrs. skills as much as possible. Wearing that leg cast, we all know is a fake. The squatters in number nineteen must Ooh, promotion, put on nice. And well new done, Agnes Brown. Is poised to we can upgrade the easy scan. Okay. Next time. I wasn't listening to the radio, just in case you wanted. I need a janitor that can do mechanics. Okay, let's see if we can get a janitor with mechanics. You got mechanics? Is that mechanics or is that maintenance? Maintenance. That's mechanics. Mechanics. Upgrade. My easy scan. When you have a moment. Okay, so the hospital doesn't look very beautiful right now. So that's something I'm going to need to work on. And I'm going to try and do it without plants if I can. Because plants need watering. And that means janitors. That means lots of... Okay, so let's put around a few things that are going to help people stay entertained. Um, and let's have a look for some... Maybe... Some, oh, gift shop. Wow. Maybe some new... Uh, things that will make the... Attractiveness and rune prestige. That sounds nice. Yucca sounds nice. Cactus sounds nice. Display skeleton for training room. Anatomy for training room. An indoor fountain. I know I need a training room. I'll do that in the next wing over, I think. Cheese water canvas. That sounds nice. Attractiveness for the hospital. This is what I want. A few of these nice, like... these nice things that I can put else everywhere like nice paintings and things a doggo painting 
a beach painting. They don't take very much. Gold Star Award. Yeah. Kitty drawings. Silver Star Award. We'll get all of these decorations. They're going to be lovely. Brain anatomy poster. Anatomy poster. I've still got enough for a large fountain, apparently. A sweet dispenser. It's happiness. Pure happiness. Drinking fountain. Okay. Get a few of these things. A big bin. Needs emptying less often. And a silver bench. I don't, I'll still use purple benches. I don't even know why I unlocked that, actually. I haven't, haven't had a need for aircon units, so I'll just not even bother with those at the moment. So, please lower your expectations. So, with a silver bench... Right, let's just go back to the corridor items so they'll be in order. Increases comfort, increases comfort, increases comfort. The bench of your futuristic chrome-plated dreams. Oh, good grief, I've just realised. Radiators everywhere! Trouble Everybody's cold! Okay, let's get a few radiators around the place. Call, smell my cash. Call, smell my cash. Interest repayment rate is nothing to sniff at. Smell my cash. Because an 80% interest repayment rate is nothing to sniff at. So I'll start off with the corridors. They're actually looking a little bit warm now. I don't know if that's too hot or whether that's okay. And then we'll get some radiators in the rooms to make them feel a little bit warmer. The only place it was warm was psychiatry because it's got a fireplace. <laughs> some in the doctor's offices. Why went that one place? Why won't you place? I imagine that needs to really go a bit further back. There we are. Okay, then one in the toilet. Actually, a large radiator maybe in the toilet. Quite a large room. Oh, we've got loads of mail as well. I need to sort that out, don't I? Radiators down either end of the ward. And then a smaller radiator. Try not, to die. Try not to die. But if you have to, don't make a mess. Okay, so hopefully that's... Oh, I have a... Okay, right, we need pest control research to happen. It looks to me like I probably need to hire another researchy doctor if I can. Hmm... No. Because honestly, I need psychiatry. Oh no, someone's waiting for pest control and they've stormed out. Okay, okay, okay. We need to sort this staff situation out then, don't we? I think this would be a better place to buy. It's got 16 days. Oh no! Uh, I need my training room. The thing is, we're needing all the rooms we've got as well. Quite often, though, the beginning of a hospital can be quite, quite tough. Grey anatomy. No, I can't do that. Night fever, psychiatry, pest control. Some staff training is required. Publicity. Update Tabitha Winsock's office has sent us this notice following her visit to the hospital. Thank you for supporting Mayor Tabitha Winsock in this time of need celebration by hosting her at your place of work home. Have a wonderful day and don't forget to vote Winsock. Okay. Okay, so uh, training is going to be like an important thing very soon. But I'm just going to keep an eye on... Uh... Yes, yes, I know, I know, I know, I know. Not now. Flemington Hospital in my inbox. Okay, so I will be doing marketing campaigns and things like that. I'll probably do them in a different wing, though. Doing alright for money, though. It seems to be quite good. 
just a couple of teething problems. Of death. Treatment failed. 58% success rate of treatment. What treatments are we even doing? This pharmacy nurse killing people. No. Who's killing people? I need to know. I don't think the general diag nurse would be. The doctor shouldn't even be, like, treating anybody. Whoever's in fluid analysis. Mm. Oh, okay, that's too cold, apparently. I thought I'd put radiators everywhere, but maybe I missed a spot. Yeah, I did. There we are. Beef, beef. Oh, yay! We can put a little training room and stuff in here now. Yeah! I quite often like to move my research room and my staff room over into a new wing once I get a new wing opened. On Tabitha so Winsor, I will do that. Out and about this fine county of ours. This very morning, she was seen bye bye. a local hospital. Well, if a visit from the mayor doesn't cure you, I don't know what will. I'll pop them down here, actually. Bink. Edit. Move. I could even make it a bit bigger, actually. It's not so ridiculously stupid looking. Move researchers' desk into a more sensible place. I could even get a couple more researchers' desks in there now. I won't do it at the moment because we don't have, even have enough doctors. So the next room I want to build is a training room. And I'd like to start training some people up. It'll only need to be quite small. So maybe like that. The desks. Add more if I need to later. I have too many janitors. You can never have too many janitors, trust me. Okay, so I would like to hire a few more doctors. Um, and I would like one to be trained in research if possible. Your jack sausage looks great. Emotional intelligence, motivation. Oh, you're a janitor. You're not a doctor. So we've got another psychiatrist here, another researcher. That's a good backup. And I would like you to go and start researching in there, just so we can get the basics covered. Pest control. Research me some pest control. And then I think I might buy, uh, get myself another psychiatry room, because it looks like they're really, really needing some extra psychiatry. I'll add cool stuff to it later, but like, I just need to get the queue down right now. I also need to pop them down somewhere to sit outside there. Just some corridor items. You want a silver bench out there? That looks nice, doesn't it? Maybe one outside the GP's offices. Maybe one outside. Well, there's plenty of room outside here, actually. One outside the ward might be nice. I did notice people queuing up there earlier and standing. And I'd much rather they could sit if they want to sit. We killed someone else. Oh, my goodness me. Mucky feet has been discovered. Press control is required. Send the patient home for now. What did you die of? You just come out of the pharmacy. I'm not so sure about this pharmacy nurse. What's your, what's your death ratio? One treatment failed. We made a 4,000 loss. That's not too bad considering how much we've built recently. Getting all 
all these psychiatry patients. We get so many mock star cases. Good grief. The daily sneer revealed the shockingly low wages. Earn 100,000. I can probably do that. The company has launched Great anatomy. Wait, I'm going to build some some treatment rooms over here then. Able to pay no wages at all, which is one way of dealing with the problem, I suppose. Rooms. Great. Great anatomy needs to be quite a large room, I think. So. The chromotherapy room? What's it called? Chromotherapy room. 21k for that. Good grief. Okay, maybe it doesn't need to be quite as large as I remember it needing to be. And we'll get a doctor over here as well. More doctors. Hi, more doctors. So many doctors. Good at treatment. Yes. Get in there. Oh, I didn't even know what you're like. Doctor cannot work in chemotherapy. What? Is it a nurse in there? Oh, I'd forgotten that. <gasps> Alright then, we'll hire a nurse that's good at treatment. Like you. Get in there. We'll get a couple of benches out. Now, what I do need to put down is a few snacks and things like that, because they're going to be a bit hungry, I imagine. I don't, need, I don't need hangry patients storming out. We'll get them a soda machine. They've got a news agents though, and a magazine rack. I mean, it's not like I've completely neglected them. Maybe a salty snacks machine somewhere. Maybe by the ward. People who are in the ward need stuff like that, right? I'm wondering what to put there. Have a treatment room of some description. I'm really glad I. There's a lot of deaths lately. It's not so good. How are you doing with pest control research? It's really slow. I suppose he's only just started though, so we'll get there. I mean, I could go back to Mitten and research it, but I prefer. I think from now on. We did all the basics in Mitten, which was really nice. It helped me get through Tumble really well. Stop running away from the ghosts. Hoover them up. You have animal magnetism too. <laughs> They've got an animal magnetically stuck to their faces. <laughs> They've got cats stuck to them. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. That's so good. That's why we need pest control. Right, I'm going to send you home though, because I I will eventually research it and be able to sort it out. But it, yeah, at the moment, we just need to like go on a faster speed, I think, and get this research done so we can get our first star. Get our, oh, this isn't even the first star. This is the marketing license. Good grief. You know, other DJs, some of them on this very station, believe it or not, can be... I don't even want to know about the awards. I'm just closing my eyes. Open all. Rising star. Anyway, I've Jules Hogwash. With kitten pictures. So hopefully we'll have nothing but happiness on the airwaves from now on. But I think we have a reasonably profitable hospital. I know it doesn't say we're making a profit right now, but we've got revenue. Oh no, we are. Mid ten thousand. Hurry up. Okay, so where's my other doctor that has um that can research. I want them to research because uh, we've cleared the queue at psychiatry now. It's not you, it's not you. I don't know if it's Gareth Eastgate that's in there already. I've got one that can do psychology and yeah, Archibald Kitten. Right, Archibald Kitten. I would like you to do to help with the research if you can. No, do you need an extra researcher's bench? Oh, hang on. You know what I need to do? Give an extra staff member. And pop you in there. There we go. Go help each other. Make it go faster. We're just going to run the hospital until that happens. I need some bins around here, I think, as well, because we've got these big bins now. 
Put one rather centrally outside the toilet. It looks to me like it's a bit of a reception queue. So I'm going to hire another assistant and put another computer pod down on reception. There we are. Why is the room not ready? Oh, okay. Does that need to be slightly ever apart? Yeah. There we are. And then we can hire another assistant. Please seem less sick and more cured. And this will be for wherever our animal magnetism room is. Henry Jobs Jobsworth is coming. Oh, hello, Henry Jobsworth. How are you doing? Ah, I'm running around. I built a training room and now I don't really need it. Well, I could train people in some stuff, I guess. But at the moment we're doing okay. Chromotherapy is working well. Research is going slowly, but it's okay. They're nearly done. They're 70% there. And the hospital seems to be making a nice big loss. Um, send the patient home. Pharmacy emergency. Six patients with potty mouth. Sure, we'll take that. Staff training required. Not now. Uh, accept. Go 90 days without a death. That's because everyone's dying. Everyone is dying, but it's cool. I think. Big GP queues here. So now what we need to do is go through the patient list. Find the ones that can just be sent straight to treatment. Mockstar, Mime Crisis. Great Anatomy. feet. All these guys waiting for the GPs as well. So I could get another GP's office or I could... Oh, she needs a toilet. Words of the day idea. A little bit too literally, I believe. His suggestions were sponge, curvature, and plonk. Well, those are How's the nice queue looking now? Him, so I'll let that Four start. in that queue. Four in that queue. That's not so bad anymore. Good, good, good. Got rid of a few of them for them. So you can get through the rest of them well. How are we doing? We're nearly there. We've nearly got the, the pre actually getting a star achievement. Woohoo! My inspection. Nice hospital. Yay! Oh. One of our county's better medical destinations, destined to be a favourite of the sickly enthusiast in the know. Well done. Yes. Sounds good. Injection room required. Um, wait and I'll make one. Send them home for animal magnetism at the moment and I will give that promotion. Okay. I'm actually going to slow it down now. We were just really waiting for the research to get through. I will build an injector room over here. to do for now it's very plain room i will be upgrading some of the rooms making them nicer put some pictures in all that sort of thing we can upgrade the easy scan again all right then and that drug mixer someone else died big gp crews okay gonna I want to make some more GP offices. Gonna move the psychiatry offices over into the corner, and then I'll be able to make some. Sorry, Freddie Mercury. We've got to edit the room. Kick you out. Sorry. 
Move that radiator slightly over. And then I can make myself another GP's office or two. And then I can start training them. No, that GP's office is fine. We could make the psychiatry room a bit bigger, possibly. Or we could put some kind of completely different room in there. I'm not really sure. Let's just make this room bigger, I think. Make it very prestigious and then have like a... That could be the secondary one. That could be the one where people go, like, if this one's occupied. But most of the time, it's like an overflow room. This is the cool room. I like the idea that the patient's just lying there and the psychiatrist is behind him, so, you don't, so there's not like eye contact there. Just like, just move out a little bit. There we are. So this room's like the rubbish room. It doesn't have much good stuff in it. This one's the cool room. Okay. Go. Inject room. I need another nurse for that, probably. I like to have a nurse per room at least, maybe with some extras. Inject a nurse. Magic healing hands. Okay, I would like uh, some more silver benches. I quite like the look of the silver benches. They're kind of quite nice and clean. Clean look through them. Okay, fracture ward. No, send them home. Be promoted. I don't have room for a fracture ward. Well, I kind of do actually. I could put one like there. In fact, I could move this uh, room over here and then put a fracture ward like all the way down there with a door in there. That would actually be a really good use of the space. Ah. Okay, great news. The Two Point Health Ministry has granted us a marketing license. This will allow us to run marketing campaigns to improve our reputation and attract more patients and staff to the hospital, build a marketing room, and hire or train an assistant with a marketing qualification to run the campaigns. Okay, can I move this now, please? Thank you very much. Do I need to make it bigger? No, I do not. I mean, if anything, I need to make it smaller and fit two rooms in here. Like, I don't need all this room. Oh, well, that's annoying. Colorizer had to move. Okay, so I can put another room there, like some toilets or the marketing room or something, right? And move these benches over here or something. And then I could put the whole fracture ward, like, down here. Oh, it's really cold in there, apparently. Rooms. Fracture ward. X-ray would go there. That's what I would put there. Fracture wood needs to be massive anyway, doesn't it? So, like, stick her there. Little thing there, some plaster casters. Put all the beds down there. Good use of the space, if you ask me. Which you probably didn't. But that's cool. I won't hold it against you. I definitely think we need more than one plaster caster. It seemed like that before, so I'll try two and we'll see how it goes. There we are. I would like x-ray as well. Pan's lab! Oh no! I need everything to be built, like, straight away. It's crazy. Okay, so if we've got animal magnetism... Wow. Then read the Daily Launch a marketing plan campaign and cure 10 news. patients with animal magnetism. So what do we need to do to do that? Because the hospital value is already going well up. Reputation needs to be improved a bit, but I can work on that. Right. Marketing room in here. 
I was going to put x-ray there, but it doesn't matter. Okay, we need that apparently. That makes a marketing room. Start a marketing campaign. Click on the marketing table or drop an assistant with a marketing qualification into the room. A bit like research. It's research for assistants. Illness campaigns attract more patients exhibiting certain symptoms and improve your reputation with specific illnesses. Note, unlock more illness campaigns by discovering more illnesses in each area. All right then. I think we're gonna need an admin wing soon. 60K, 60K, 50K. That was 50K. That was 55. And this little tiny one over here is 40. Oh, that would be an amazing little admin wing. Stick everything in there. Okay, let's get some radiators and then I will, I promise I'll look at training soon, okay? Sorry guys. I've got to deal with things like there being no heating first. You know, just seems to, to matter to you more, you know? I don't know why they need heating, you know? Coming from me, like the coldest person in the world. I'm, I'm always like, I always check. I'm like, Ava, can you cold? Can I put the heating on? Are you cold? Are you sure you're not cold? And I remember when I was little, my grandfather always asking me the same thing. Like, are you warm enough? And I used to be like thinking, oh, you're just like being really sweet and checking that I'm warm enough. But actually, I think it was more like he was cold. And he's just checking to see if like, he was making it up or whether actually it was cold and using me as a barometer. My money is low. Well, of course it is. I've spent it on everything. I've, I've been playing this for 45 minutes and we're on our third expansion already. I'm playing quite aggressively, so I'm not surprised that we've run out of money. Promotion. Special report. Pan's lab is still required. Darn it. Send the patient home. Research is complete. Hurrah. Special report. I cured four out of six patients. That gives me extra reputation, which is great. Um, jazz hand is discovered. But that is ward treatment. Okay, that's not too bad. Pest control. Hang on. I should have read that. Oh, maybe. I can't anymore. Next time, I, next time they discover Chaz Hand, I will, I will read it. I promise, because someone has clearly taken the the time to to do all of this. So level four psychiatry. I can do that definitely. I've got a really nice psychiatry thing. Um, get the patient to wait. We're gonna build pest control because what we're gonna do is move the staff room. I know, all I ever do is move rooms, but I like to have these things in their own little places. Staff room uh, around here. Rock bottom has been discovered. Okay, I promised I would read it. No, I don't want to stop editing the room. I just want to move it. Okay, petrification of the backside, making it appear weathered and grey. Caused by low quality chairs. We'll send the patient for treatment in our injection room. Oh no! Oh, ooh! Boggled mind. A severe boggling of the mind, often caused by exposure to new, sometimes paradigm altering information. Through careful analysis of this condition, scientists have been able to derive the equation mind equals blown. Sadly, this equation has proven to be entirely useless. Useless? I can't even say the word useless. We'll send the patient for treatment in our psychiatry. I know we don't have an assistant yet. I haven't done that bit yet. Let me, give me a chance. Oh look, that would just so happen to fit exactly in that space. Very nice. I like it. I like it a lot. I don't really know what I'll do with these little tiny areas here. Have a snack, we'll be right back. Put the, put the stuff from miles away, Sheila, because that won't make everyone have to walk for miles. Mind you, they have like 20 day breaks in this, so like they should have time to walk there, right?
Okay, animal magnetism room on the way. Pest control. I don't know how big pest control needs to be. Quite big. It's quite a big machine, actually. Put it that way around. It'll fit better. Pest control room. Okay, so we're going to need an assistant. We're going to need a nurse for this room. That can do treatments preferably. Holly, you're going in there. Okay, so Holly's going to go in there and then we're going to get an assistant who has marketing. Do you know what? This hospital is actually really quite profitable even without any paintings or anything anywhere. Customer service, motivation, training, masterclass, customer service, motivation. Hmm. Well, you learn fast, so how about we just pop you in the training room, get you trained up in... Marketing. I'll pay for it, it's cool. You, do, you go do your marketing training. With your back to front desk. Oh, I haven't played this in a while and I kept forgetting about the back to front desks. Level 4 psychiatry, apparently we need. Alright, let's make this a bit, a bit nicer. It's about time I made some of the rooms a bit nicer. Assistant to, marketing. Assistant to marketing. Right, we need a Rorschach poster. No self-respecting psychiatry would not have one of those. A cheese water canvas might be quite nice between those uh, bookshelves. Point radio. Um, this is maybe a point nice. Radio, and uh, I am Nigel Bickleworth at your service. And so we begin another of our shows mm, with a little something what else I like to call music. I'm just looking at corridor items. Let's see if there's any particular items. Oh, man. Maybe a flower or something in there. Maybe a yucca. It's quite attractive. Doesn't need much watering. Very thirsty and very bored. And there's a news agent, right? Oh, I maybe need some more um, assistants actually, so that one will do the news agents. Someone with good customer service skills. There we go. Go do the news agents. Then they'll be a bit less thirsty and bored. And let's see if we can put a couple more vending machines around. Energy drinks. Yeah. Because they never did anyone any harm, right? A bit of luxury drinks as well. Would all visitors please, talk silently? please talk silently. A couple of bits that I kind of need moving because we've messed around with the layout. Move you. Okay, all well, this is looking good. So marketing is completed. Fantastic. So you pop over here and do a marketing campaign. I would like a small campaign to get a few more people in for... Oh, hang on. Let's get the animal magnetism campaign. That's what we need. A high-pitched whistle is used to attract crazy animal people. I like it. Let's attract these crazy animal people. Mood poisoning. I want to have a look at the heating overlay. I haven't looked at that in a while, so... There's a little bit of chilliness around the new wing. A little bit of chilliness over here as well, so let's just get my radiators out. Actually, let's try and use a small radiator in little spaces like that. Did someone die? That's the wrong way around. I suppose if I pop it there, then that's the right way around, technically. We need Pan's Lab! Oh, okay, it's going to have to go over here or something, I think. 
Unless I can fit it in that tiny space there. Space in all this county than the meltdowns. Nothing but a toxic wasteland. Why, when I was a lad, it was merely a wasteland. <laughs> That's progress for you. It was merely a wasteland, and now it is a toxic wasteland. Lovely. I wonder if I can get a pans lab in in this space. It's a small, it would be a really small room. Oh, I need that overlay off. I can't see. No, it needs a minimum. Yeah, stop editing it. We've got a ghost hanging around. The room, there's, there's room for something by there as well. Let's see if I can get it in there. Pans lab. We've got so much more that we need to build though. Fantastic. Pans lab, there we are. Just the very basics. Where's all my janitors? It was telling me I had too many janitors a minute ago, so you need to... You need to up your janitor game and get over here with your ghost capture machines. Otherwise known as vacuum cleaners. Marketing campaign is going. The ultrasonic cannon. I really want to know what they do with the ultrasonic cannon. Oh my goodness me. I'm not being very micromanagey with this, and I wonder if that. Oh, well, I've got a reputation of 70% now, so that's fine. We've killed one animal magnetism patient. I could do it. No, yeah, more nurses. More nurses. More treating -y nurses. Nurses, you're all rubbish. Why are they all injecting nurses? Let's see who comes in the next couple of days. Definitely getting faster at the early stages of the hospital now. They're all just injections of pharmacy. It's driving me mad. They're hiring you, Trevor Spanner. Go in there. Let's have a look at your stats. Your treatment is 40%. It's better than nothing. Better than nothing. There's someone in the fracture ward who is about to die, apparently. Assistant required in reception. Very close to death. Julie is very, very uh, good at her job, though. Got a massive fracture ward and no one in it. Maybe I should have made a small one. Promote! Promote! Cross bones, new uh, illness discovered. Skeletal rage sometimes triggered by piracy. Refires the fracture ward. We'll send the patient to treatment in the fracture ward. Go on, train now. Along with Agnes Brown. Why don't we train you both in ward management? Oh, I can't do that. I need someone that's already got ward. Anyone else got ward? That can be trained? No. Okay, why don't you guys get trained in treatment then, maybe? So I can just like be a little bit more flexible with where you're going. Oh, except not you. Ah, uh, drives me mad. It's like uh, they're all needing to be trained in different things. Right, treatment. So they can all be a bit better at treatment, just in general, across wherever they need to go. Actually, we've got enough money to just like go for the Meredith beard. I'm trying to stay on top of the training a little bit, but I don't want too many people out of action at once. General diagnosis is absolutely rammed full of people. Wow.
Which I've got such a good easy scan room. So I kind of almost need an overflow for it. There would be a good place for an overflow though. General general diag too. That'll do me. Nurse, please go to the farm. Promotion. So many promotions. Eight rep. Yes, good rep. Staff training required, no. Objections emergency, sure. Who's in there now? Someone who's good at injections, that's always great. Okay, the general diag queue is going down a little bit now. End of year approaching. More nurses! I'm just going to get a really low grade nurse in that second general diagnostics. Oh, this is a crazy employer of the we we are not doing well on this hospital. Like we're really not. Generate five hundred research points. Well, do you know what? I've realised I've got these doctors, and we could upgrade pest control. Okay, do a project to do that then. Here come my injection patients. I don't know why they're coming in here. This is not where the injection room is. Unless they're animal magnetism patients. Or unless they need... In today's guide to good manners, oh no, the injection room is over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Calls, That's the fluid analysis room over there. Stations. Firstly, do not shout. Speak in a calm, clear voice. Preferably in a voice you would deem too posh for everyday conversation. State your name and be polite at Let's all times. Let's get some times. Like, food and drink also, things over here. Do not call me names and then quickly hang up. That is the height of rudeness. Do not call me names and quickly hang up. That is the height of rudeness. Okay, guys. I think I've done as much as I... I, I tried really hard to get this, the first star within the first episode. We're not far off. We just got to get some animal magnetism patients in from my marketing campaign over here. I hope we're doing it at the moment. Apparently we are. I don't know. I don't know what's happening over here. Click to launch a marketing campaign. I thought we already had an animal magnetism one. Have some more money. You haven't. You didn't even get one animal magnetism patient in. You are rubbish at marketing. You suck. Anyway, with that in mind, um, I would like to say goodbye. And you can come and see me next time and see how I did with the animal magnetism uh, marketing campaign and whether I can get the animal magnetism patients in. And hopefully I will be able to. So if you like this episode, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more Two Point Hospital, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you all next time. In the meantime, though, Please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.